riders what's going on another uh indoor ride home review um just because yeah trying to get trying to get back on track for 2019 and this this time around uh i watched or this week i watched mary queen of scots which stars sarcy ronan uh margot robbie guy pierce and david tennant um and is directed by Josie Rourke. Before I get into that, don't forget to subscribe to Ride Home Reviews to catch all the reviews that happen each week on YouTube and like on Facebook if you'd rather watch it there or uh, follow on Instagram to see where it's coming up and or Anchor if you like to listen to things on the go uh, in a podcast format. Yeah. So there you have it. Uh, before I get into that, um, well... So don't forget to subscribe to all those. Anyway, moving right along, uh, Mary Queen of Scots obviously takes uh, is about Mary Queen of Scots as she returns home to Scotland from France, and um, and it's kind of a tumultuous time because she's taking a role uh, that was pre uh, taking uh, the uh, monarchy monarchical role that her brother was holding for her in Scotland as well as England wants Scotland to become part of them as a whole Great Britain, and so she has a little bit of a rivalry with Queen Elizabeth. Uh, so you have two female monarchs at the same time um, who are loosely related. I don't know. It's, it's that monarch, monarch stuff. So anyway, getting into it, what did I like? First of all, I thought the cast was really well cast, and they did a marvelous job. Um, the, whole, the whole ensemble was uh, very well it was very well done and interesting and everybody uh, played their role to the fullest. I thought they did a great job. I thought that the art direction and the costuming and the hair, especially the hair was very noticeable. Um, uh, all that was pretty pretty cool. I don't know how accurate it was, but it was really cool and I liked how they um, developed a difference between the look of Scotland and the look of England. Um, so you knew where you were in time other than the accents. Um, so, so there was that. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it was just really, it looked really, really good. Um, and of course, uh, Cersei, Cersei Ronan was very, uh, dominant on the screen as, as Mar playing the role of Mary. Um, so that was really, uh, so, uh, technically, um, and uh, creatively with the cinematography and so on, it's spot on. It's really good. Um, the issue that I had was with the story. It seemed that um, the director and the writers didn't know which way to go with this, as in rivalry. Was it uh, the fact that these monarchs were women and the men didn't like it. Was it a rivalry between Elizabeth and Mary? It just was muddled. Um, it just w didn't handle well. It was, um, the flow was confusing. Um, you're trying to do some character development in the midst of conflicts that you don't know which direction you're going in. Um, I thought they should have picked one or the other because the way the whole movie flowed, like I said, it was disjointed. Um, I mean, there was rival factions here, but then there's rival factions there, and I just it just didn't work. It just didn't work, and it, therefore it left an ending that was very incomplete and unsatisfying. So, um, but what to watch for is in the editing. There was some composition and some editing position that really juxtaposed Mary and Queen Elizabeth, played by Margot Robbie. Roby, Robbie. Um, so that was pretty cool. Um, but all in all, it was an okay movie. If you like period films, this won't, this won't, uh, uh, this will give you an edge towards that. But most of all, it's really disappointing in the story. So there you have it. Mary Queen of Scots. Don't forget to subscribe on YouTube, like on Facebook, follow on Instagram and Anchor. So until next time, watch something cool. Thanks everybody.